July 10, 2014, this guinea pig came in with a uh, running nose on one side, the left nostril, and has been uh, hospitalized for three days. Today's, today's the third day, and uh, the nose is still running. And uh, so now we clean up the nose first. We clean up the nose so that he can breathe. Injections were given subcutaneous for two days, antibiotics, anti-inflammatory. We clean up the nose. This is part of nursing. Okay, then we, we put eye drops. The, the eyes also, there is some eye, eye, eye infection. It's a re upper respiratory tract infection. So we put eye drops and uh, clean up the eyes. Both eyes, yeah. At least uh, three times a day we better. The owner has to do all this. Yeah. Then wipe away all the, all the discharge. After this, after wiping away the eye discharge, we have to clean the ears. The ears are dirty or so. The owner will send the, the guinea pig for grooming. He has not been groomed. So he might get infected. Yeah. We will use the, the swab to, to just clean the ear first. It will go for grooming later. Eh? They use a swab, right? the swab. Just clean out the, the outside of the ears. It, it's very dirty. Most owners don't clean the ears or check the eyes. So all the dirt might have gone into the eyes and the nose. Is it very dirty? Yes. The other ear. Temporarily, we just clean the the, the other ear because it's black in color, so the owner can't uh, see the dirt actually. Okay. Then we cut the nails. Have a quick cut there, yeah. turn sideways. Uh, the, the, the assistant hold the guinea pig sideways. Sideways, sideways. We uh, have a quick cut, the nail shot there. Yeah. Because the guinea pig is going home today. Just a fast clip, uh, clip, clip, clip. Don't take too long, just clip, clip. Uh. Okay. And. Uh, Oh, this should be done by the owner actually. If not, then regular yeah. grooming the back leg. Ready. Back leg done, ready. Done. 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 Okay. So now, after that, the third day of injection antibiotics subcutaneous under the neck. We will give under the neck, and uh, it's quite a thick skin. So so we, so uh, hold hold properly. The assistant should hold properly. Uh, Slowly, uh, vitreo plus a dextrosiline. Okay, so now the guinea pig will be given uh, the nutrients, hyperplex and violet bees. Now, normally it's three times a day. It's about one ml, three times a day. It's slowly, slowly. Uh, you need assistance to help you to hold because sometimes the guinea pig doesn't like it. Slowly, slowly. Drop by drop, and uh, so the medic take the fiberplex, the, the tube there, the tube. Uh, so I think it jam up uh, the two cc. Now at the side there, the cheek there, uh, the cheek pouch at the side slowly. Let, let him let him swallow, then take out again slowly, little bit by little bit, uh, little bit at a time because. Finish? Yes, uh, normally we put some water in, but now we give the, the electrolytes at the side of the mouth. Slowly again, let them, let them swallow uh, some more, slowly. These are the electrolytes. Did the guinea pig pass motion? Yeah, I have. Did, uh, yeah. So we, we did feed water yesterday as well, as well as a fiberplex, otherwise it wouldn't. Pass motion. Uh.
Oh, don't give too fast, otherwise, otherwise all drop out from the mouth. Yeah. Okay, a bit more. Okay, now we're going to get some water, one ml of water, and then uh, to 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 feed. Now you're going to get one water first. So other than that, is you can see this guinea pig had this uh, respiratory tract infection, the respiratory tract infection, and uh, been here for three days. So if when it goes home, we we will give the antibiotics B2 and Melaxochem three times, two times a day at the 0.2 ml. Other than that, uh, the usual uh, water. 1 ml, probably uh, three times a day. Uh, slowly, let's see that. Okay, a bit more, a bit more. And uh, clean the nose. The owner has to do all this because it takes a few days to recover. Okay, now, now the guinea pig can go back to the cage to rest.